Hi guys, it's Okay One here. Welcome. Let's play. Leap of faith. The group gets sandwiched by zombie hordes while on a cliffside road. Without a car, the only way to escape was by jumping and ho hoping for the best. The fall was painful, but not fatal. So we all got a little bit hurt. This always happens when you're without a car. You get constantly like uh, a bit damaged. Um, yeah, cat attack. DSYP is walking along the road when he is suddenly mauled by a feral cat. Four cats go to the United States after some some apocalypse. <laughs> you never see them, but they're always watching, waiting for any weakness. Yeah, like all cats. This YP is hurt and his morale decreased. Great. Last street in the world. There's a city ahead, rotten with zombies. The group knows that walking through a city street like this is a bad idea, but a car weighs at the end of it. So our zombie forecast is very thick and they're hunting and it's late morning. The only option we got is to walk through anyway. I really, 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 really hope we don't die now because I want to continue this playthrough. So we just have to kick some ass. Okay, let's see what we got. Now, I think now is a good time to bring, um, bring out the pipe bombs again. Okay. We're all already seriously hurt, and we're <laughs> gonna do this, great. Okay. And I'm, I don't know, I hope we get some gas along the way so I can bring out my chainsaw, or maybe I should bring out my gun, I don't know. What do you think? Yeah? You do? Okay, yeah, I agree. Chainsaw is always the better option. So I think I'm gonna, uh, give my gun to Seth, so if he finds some ammo, feel free to shoot. Because now we got our meat cleaver and we also got two pipe bombs in case uh, huge swarms. And we got the chainsaw and we're gonna get some gas. She's got a <laughs> yeah, piece of wood <laughs> and the crowbar and her sword. But she's also much of a sword and he's got a hatchet. That's all he gets. <sighs> okay, we're not gonna die, we're not gonna die. Let's go. Get out of my way! Yes! Yes! You see all that gas? My god! Isn't my tactic? It's always just to avoid yourself this and just walk around in it. Yes! Look at all the gas! Okay, I'm gonna bring out my chain! My chain! So, I'm sure. Just have to. Yes! But now that we're gonna get a car, I should probably save up my food. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, there's a car! This is way better than expected. Or pro. We found a lot of gas and destroyed 37 zombies. Great job. Okay. Choose your fate. The group gets a peaceful moment to rest in a safe house. No zombies in sight. With some spare time, they decide to either exercise the strength or teach mechanic skills or teach medical skills. Uh, medical, definitely. Well, that was my initial thought, anyway. Um, it's probably... We can, we can check their status. So we don't know shit about the DSYP dude. Um, and she's really fit so she doesn't need to but she could teach fitness to Seth or to Carolyn okay but I think it's always a good thing to have medical you know what I do and we don't even know these people's medical skills it's only okay I think we're definitely gonna go with medical cuz then maybe they'll reveal those skills or if we not if they don't reveal them we're gonna increase them so Kellen teaches everyone that what she knows about emergency medical care and see me painless dentistry. Wow, mm, sounds uh, great. So okay, so they didn't reveal anything, but they increased. Because if Carolyn decides to leave the group for some reason, or if she's dying, and uh, then we have to switch the leader. And um, 
I need people to know medical then. Okay. And is healed a bit by Carolyn. Good. And Carolyn is fully healed by Carolyn. Yeah. <laughs> she, <laughs> she decides to heal herself most. And the group continues to praise on death row uh, as long as one person remains alive, the dream of Canada lives on. You have 14 feet left. Unexpectedly, the group finds someone they can trade with. Yeah, we're uh, in the Walmart. Okay, let's see. Fitness instructor. This woman is decked out in sweatpants, lamb, warmers, and garnish exercise. Oh, ga garish? Garish? Um, exercise clothes. Um. She's been continually running in place this whole time. I love the descriptions of the people in this game. Uh, yeah, for different So we could be trained, trained or charmed or just leave. Well, I'm not gonna pay six for, for, for that, but we could always try to charm them. Molly gets free fitness training. She sweats from the intense exercise. It didn't actually improve her fitness, but it was free! <laughs> yeah. Choice. I did absolutely nothing. And uh, the last anime sale. Uh, this man said an anime and anime accessories from a converted food truck. I am doing my part to keep civilization together. One anime sale at a time. <laughs> okay, so we can buy you no anime or four katanas for five. Four katanas? Or anime figurine for ten food? Yeah. Smart. I think we're gonna go with that. Or five shuriken, shuriken for one foot. What's that? For one foot, that was cheap. No, I don't think. Seriously, uh, a katana would be nice, but uh, uh, when I try to buy katanas from other people in the game, there have been some cheap replicas, so they like break the very first at the very first swing. I'm not gonna buy any. I just love they included an uh, anime salesman in here. Um, it's an old but fit man in matching grey sweatpants and sweatshirt. He screams something about BUILDING MASS AND BULK with an intense strength routine. He flails towards some heavy objects lying around. You have 40 foot left. So we can get training again in strength, but I don't think that... Oh yeah, that one was fitness, but I don't think... That's so important. We need our food. We're four people and the 14 food or what, what it was we have left, that's not gonna last very long. Okay, nothing else to see in there? Nope. Okay, let's go. This didn't help us at all, but it was a nice. Let's do something else for a change, I guess. Give her. Zero zombies destroyed. Oh, gee, thanks for that update. <laughs> I was wondering. A full heal by Carolyn. Yeah, she and she treats some of their wounds. Why? I think you never, you're never able to heal everyone fully at like one time. So you have to like spread it out. Okay, tunnel gauntlet. The group accidentally disturbs a lot of undead while scouting a city. This causes a chain reaction of blunders, and they're soon surrounded. Their only chance is running through a tunnel in the road. Oh, so we lost our car. And the swarm size is very thick! Three exclamation, excla exclamation marks. And they're hunting in the late afternoon. Okay, but at least I got my chainsaw, right? Yes, and I got a lot of kids. And Seth, you didn't find any ammo. Oh. Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna... We have no other choice. Okay. Yes. I think I... No. I was wondering if I could also hit people with my chainsaw without, like, turning it on. That would've been nice. Yeah. The only night... Down... Oh, yes. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I got, uh, disturbed by the car. So sometimes it will cars like this, they have stuff inside, then if it's gas, you have to like stand there for as long as it takes to empty the car. So, yes, this is a mistake. No, whoa, what happened? I lost my, my chainsaw. No, yes, it is, it's right there. Yeah. 
I just dropped it? No, I'm, I'm on fire! No! <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly I'm on fire. Yeah, we're just gonna use all of our gas. And hopefully uh, there'll be a car at the end. But that will already be like loaded. That's what we strategy for now. Oh, it's so intense! Really? <laughs> Did you see him like spinning around? Oh, the Royal cars! Yes! Oh, we're over there. No, we're gonna hit the road. Okay, we destroyed 86 sound bases at least. Oh. <laughs> oh! That was quite intense. And um, glimmer of hope on death row. The group feels inspired after managing to survive that situation. They feel like they're getting the hang of this. Yeah, we are. Choose reward for the group. So morale and random skill gain or to fitness. For Carolyn or shooting or mechanical. Well, sometimes mechanical could be nice. Um, uh, if our car starts to break down, break down, they might be able to fix it. But let's see our morale. Well, the SYP's morale is not the best. You know what? I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go with mechanical now. All these cars aren't getting any less broken. So, so now, okay, so now we revealed. <laughs> Look at the mechanical on set. <laughs> it could not have been worse. It's like me. Um, okay, so they were all pretty terrible, but at least we increased some of them. Good. This is all just like my online zombie video games. <laughs> Miserable camping. The, groups couldn't, the group couldn't find any safe shelters, but was able to cobble together a campsite. The weather is terrible all night. Carolyn didn't mind it much. No. But Seth's morale decreased, and Marlin didn't mind much, but the SYP did mind. Uh, the group eats a decent meal, and we lost eight food. The SYP's morale increased. Good. <laughs> Out of gas, really? <laughs> so, oh yeah, we didn't lost our car at the first. I realized that first now. Wow, great. Okay, but now we 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 don't have any car left. Uh, what am I trying to say? Now we abandoned our car because it's out of gas. Okay then. <coughs> Rough, rough terrain. The group runs into a particularly rough stretch of road. There's nothing life threatening about it, just a long and miserable walk. They get bruised and battered in multiple small accidents. <laughs> Everyone is hurt. Carolyn's morale decreased. Oh, everyone's morale decreased. Okay, great. Abandoned luck. The group is fortunate to find an abandoned cabin in the woods to stay night in. Shortly after set setting up, a storm moved in. Luckily for them that they found the cabin in time. And all the morale increased again. So now we're just like on a roller coaster in the at the morale aspect. So <laughs> okay, it's not not that bad. Fuck okay, it. And then they're happy again. Okay. And uh, the group's long food and it's half half as much. And the morale decreased again, yeah. So we need to find some food. Heal up. Kind of rolls up her sleeves and start tending to their wounds. Uh, treat some of the wounds. Uh, she runs low on medical supplies. Okay, we need to raid something and loot all the rooms. Cabin at, cabin at the end of the road. After hours of hiking, the group finds a car sitting along the uh, country road. It's in great shape, but the keys are missing. A cabin is visible up the north. So swarm size is thick and they're hunting and it's nightfall. So now we gotta search for the keys and get a car. Hopefully there will be some other stuff in the cabin as well because we need food and medical and gas and we need uh, practically everything okay i got my chainsaw but i haven't got any gas yeah great okay. so that's our car and yes look at this awesome okay let's check out this cabin 
Bye.